Hey guys, Jeremy here. Uh, Brittany and I decided to come back for day two of the Universal Studios garage sale. Um, at the end of the live stream from yesterday, the replay, um, you're, we're gonna go ahead and do a un, uh, kind of like a haul video. We uh, spent a couple hundred bucks. I uh, got quite a bit of stuff um, after the discount. It was just a little bit over like $150, but um, we'll go over all that in the video in just a few minutes. So enjoy the replay of the live stream from yesterday and then uh, stay tuned at the end to see uh, everything we got. All right guys, Jeremy here from I Come Here For The Food. We are at the Universal Studios garage sale. I'll see if I can find some stuff for my nephews and maybe some stuff for Brittany. Not quite level. Let me level this out a little bit better there, guys. There we go. Hello. You have your ATID? I do. Do I need to show it again? Yes, please. Oh, they checked it over there? Yeah. I guess they're getting triple uh, uh -huh. picky. Hey, yes, understood. I appreciate it. Thank you. All right, this is small. Hey, good morning, John. How are you doing today? Did I do some cussing there just a second ago? This place is crazy this morning. Sorry. This place is crazy this morning. So this this started at 7. I got here a few minutes ago. Uh, all right. Now I want to look at shirts. That's what I came here for. Brittany, I'm not sure that was an extra large, not a double X. Uh, thing one and thing two. Oh, this is the teacher. Teacher of all things. I wonder if my mom would like this shirt. What do you think, Brittany? This is a, it looks like a hoodie, actually. I don't think she would like that. having a hard time keeping up with me. Brittany, did you want me to check to see if they have that yellow shirt um, in your size? stuff. Well, it's, uh, it's medium. 
are. All right, so let me see. We got infant, then adult, small, extra small, small, small. Oh, Brittany, I think uh, most of the uh, large stuff is. I don't see it in large. I only see that in extra large, Brittany. Stuff underneath. Hmm. We're gonna move this over here so you can see it. Do you like this? It's a sleeveless uh, Death Eater shirt. I think you would like that, so I'm gonna get it. Oh, here's ET. I got back in. You like this shirt? It's your size. Do you like that? I think they have a couple, so I can come back. I apologize. I know the uh, stream is not very strong over here. So I'm going to go ahead and re-upload this just so you guys can see what I'm seeing. That's youth. These are accessories. Good stuff. Yeah, I know I'm absolutely losing you guys. So 
guys these are There's no service here. This is absolutely trash <laughs> from a from a uh, live streaming perspective. stream Hey guys, hello, good morning. Uh, Jeremy and Brittany here from I Come Here for the Food. Uh, we are here to show off a little bit of what we got from the um, annual garage sale at Universal Studios. Um, so let's get started. Uh, we're over here at the, the, uh, the Riviera Resort in on Disney property, which is kind of weird. We're doing Universal, but you know, it is what it is. Close enough. Close enough. <laughs> Steam park. So, anyway start off this is the only thing we were able to actually get for our nephew this is a spider-man shirt yeah it's windy out here so sorry um, a little sleeveless normally this shirt is uh, $25 we're, we're gonna go over the, the discounted grade for all of this stuff at the end of the video got myself a lanyard CET yeah <laughs> God, I want that shirt so bad and I can't find it anywhere. Then I got Brittany, a Kiss Me I'm Irish. This shirt is uh, normally, I believe, $30. $30. So if you want to see me at Universal every year, come during St. Patrick's Day, because now I have to wear it. Just, she's, uh, it's contractually <laughs> obligated at this point. It's a thing. And then this appears to be a woman's shirt, but I'm not sure. We were thinking about who was gonna wear this. It's gonna be Brittany, it's Jurassic Park. We were here first. She likes this shirt. She's always liked this shirt. She points it out every time we go. I mean, it looks kind of a little bit like a muscle shirt, so I could just put that little tank top underneath yeah. and make it a muscle shirt. She's got guns. She's got the guns. Got some guns. Yeah. So that shirt's usually $35. So if you're running an Italian in your head, um, I'm not sure where we're at, but it's over $100 already. I'm a bad Tyler. Alright, and then here we go. We got a Death Eaters. This shirt, I believe, is also $35. This shirt, this shirt is still in the parks. If you go over there, I'm pretty sure you can still find it. You can still find it. Over in um, Nocturne Alley. Right at Nocturne Alley? Yep. Yeah. It's real soft. I really like it. I, I touch it every time I go there because I really want it, but I don't want to have to pay full price for it. Yep. Every time we go, she literally puts her hands on it. It's just Oh, I like his shirt. <laughs> Most of the stuff in there is really soft. And every time we're there, I say, why don't you get it? Why don't you get it? So I got it. 
Alright, lastly, The Wizarding World of Harry Potter and Universal Studios. Also for Brittany. Yeah, Brittany made out. She made out real well. And it was it was pretty hard to find like the different sizes, like if, if you're specific size. If this one is an extra large. I'm gonna probably do the extra large. I'm normally a large, but when you go there, they're sat on little tables. So each one is like an adult medium, adult large, adult extra large. So you just kind of have to pick through what's there on that table. And then the only thing I got for myself, the lever, lemon, uh, sherbet lemon. Sherbet lemon. You have to these, say it like that. These are normally. This is from. Uh, Honey Dukes, normally 25 bucks. You know what the sherbet lemon is? I told you. Yes, I do. You have to remember. What is it? I don't know, I just said. All right, and then the last thing we got was wait, the wait, wait, in the comments, tell me what the sherbet lemon is. What's the significance? She's so excited about this. Every time we see her Because I like the way here, she says it. Every time. She gets so excited. And I don't, I can't remember Sherbet what it lemon. Is. And then. Somebody will tell you and you're going to be like, oh, The last oh, thing, me. Brittany. <laughs> <laughs> She's so excited. <laughs> the last thing we got was a pair of kudas uh, for Brittany. So we go to um, Volcano Bay quite a bit because we like the water parks too. And uh, she keeps talking about getting a new pair of these. So they only had two sizes, no, three sizes. Five, eight, and 13. Very cute. They had some children sizes too, those small. Yeah, but none of them fit me, so I get to go barefoot. <laughs> like a heathen. So anyway. Um, I think we just did the math on this stuff a few minutes ago. It came out to a total of $137. Uh, just shy of $237. Um, and that was with going both days. On day two, it was there was less to get than day one. Um, still a pretty good selection, but there were people that were there the moment it opened. So there was really no chance to get some of this stuff. But you said that there were, um, he, he went the first day, I went the second day with him yesterday. Yesterday, yeah. yeah. Yesterday, and uh, he said that there are people, uh, people that work there, they are putting different stuff out constantly. They're always rotating. As, as, as soon as the table gets empty, they bring more stuff out. So there were a few things that, that weren't there on day one, just a few. So I wouldn't, I wouldn't feel bad. Like if I could only come on the last day, I still wouldn't feel bad because I think they're probably still putting things on the table. So you would be you would be able to see the things that people on the first day couldn't even see. Everything we bought on the first day was still there on day two. So we could have just, we could have, except for the honeydukes, the sh sherbet lemon. That was the only thing. Did you I say it right? Did I do it right? This was the only thing that wasn't there on day two. So, and of course it had expired prior to day one. It's fine. It's, it's It'll be fine. I'm not going to die. I grew up on a farm eating worms. It's sugar. This is fine. This won't kill me. <laughs> I'm gonna try one. Yeah. So, yeah. So anyway, guys, if they do. The, I think they do this every fall, and they have a spring one too. Well, they used to have one in the spring. Last year, I don't think they did one at all. Yeah, I don't remember one last year. And I know the first time I went was two years ago, and that was awesome. That one was a really good one. It, had, was, it had some good. Like he got me like. Oh, couple of hoodies. They were nice. Yeah, there was one, uh, one that was said England, and then the other one was uh, Harry Potter. Mm -hmm. There was, I think, I spent close to five hundred dollars year one. Yeah, there were some really good ornaments too. Well, I think it would the total was five hundred dollars, but I think I spent like one hundred and eighty. Yeah. It wasn't it wasn't five hundred. It was a significant amount of money, but it wasn't that much. Yeah, I'm glad we can go every year. Now this this year they didn't announce it until like a week beforehand, I think. Yeah, it was the uh, Universal Orlando annual pass holder. That's that's what I saw. The Facebook group. The Facebook, yeah. Facebook group. And I saw it, and as soon as I saw it, I yelled at him. <laughs> she sure did. Garage sale! She texted me and then called me, <laughs> which she never calls and texts, you know, at the same time. <laughs> so, so he knew he had to come. I, yeah, yeah. So <laughs> anyway, it was it was a good it was a good time. Um, it was definitely something I would do again. Uh, yeah, we're gonna do that again. I, I know it would be hard to plan a trip around it, but if you're if you just happen to be in town, it's so worth it. I mean, they they sell enough stuff that you can buy a book bag to take extra stuff home if you need to. Yeah, they, yeah, they had a book book for sale. It was a nice one too. So. All right, guys. So we are heading over to Hollywood Studios today to live stream. So we're gonna go ahead and. Uh, wrap it up here and uh, we will see you guys in Hollywood Studios.
So have a good day. Yeah. Whether or not that worked, I'm done. Okay. Oh, okay.